Recently, I finished watching a Japanese film titled Perfect Days. While some thought this movie was a lame documentary about a daily life of a toilet cleaner in Tokyo, to me, I felt deeper connection with the main cast, Hiroyama. We get caught up in this idea that life needs to be this big, complex puzzle and often seek joy in bigger things. While doing so, the little things are discarded on the periphery of our lives. The very joy we achieve from bigger things can be built into everyday life and we don't have to wait for it if we start seeing little things as not so little. It is more like a bunch of small pieces that fit together. Your favorite song, a good meal, a solid nap. In the film, Hirayama enjoys his lunch while observing the sun rays peeping through the leaves of the trees. At that moment, I realized the world is so much beautiful and joy to look at when you pay a little bit more attention and notice little things. I also take in his advice with great appreciation. Now is now, next time is next time. Simple yet so powerful. I'm gradually changing my outlook on life, bringing little things to the center of my life. Having a fixed routine is effective, but gets mundane at times. But to me, it is little things that helps me to thrive when life gets tough, repetitive, and quiet. In my slow-paced rhythm of everyday life, I find joy in being able to afford time to experiment my hobbies, being able to work on affordable housing, being able to run in my favorite park, being able to eat home-cooked food at work, being able to video call with loved ones, being able to receive kindness people have shown to me, being able to see this one, being able to just exist as I am. Being able to live, learn and realize new things to this life. The good, the bad, the great, the ugly, the unspoken, the mundane, the extraordinary.